touching the truth. We are live at AEW, and just like always, Cody Rose is ready for his TNT Championship defense. We are here live on TNT. Is in the ring, and he is asked, "Who wants his title? Want the day in a what the hell?" What the hell is this? This dude has some nerves coming into the ring like this. Making an entrance like this of all places. The first show out of quarantine. And this dude brings a motorcycle to the arena. You have to be kidding me. I am here to make a statement. I'm not here to make friends, and I'm definitely not here to congratulate you last week on defending your title against some bum. Look, Cody, this is my time. You might say you are, uh, you come from the dirt, you come from the dirt, Cody? You don't come nowhere near the dirt. You come from rich and high. I come from the dirt. I've come from apartments with rats and roaches in it. You, Cody, are nothing but a pretty boy that has everything given to him. And tonight, I will end that. I am the king. My name is Shamar. I don't give a damn about what anybody thinks of me. I give a damn about what I do in this ring. And today, I will take that TNT championship from you. I'm going to prove you right now of the spoiled son of a bitch you just are. And here we go. Shamar saying the champion is just a spoiled pretty boy who gets everything he wants. And here we go. Oh my god. Uh, what strikes from Shamar? Oh, and a clothesline from Cody Rose. Into the pin now. And a kick out at one. And we are back and forth here. And a DDT. Russian leg sweep by Shamar. And now a snap suplex. Oh, went for a spinning knee strike. And now Cody Rose has him on top. Oh, wait. A reversal. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, wow. Dragon screw by Cody. And Cody Rose is sent out the ring. And look at this. Showing off is Shamar. Oh, my gosh. And Cody... Right back, rookie mistake by Shamar showing off, but now he's right back with a float over DDT again. Shamar favoring that move, and another DDT. Need to take that shit out of my moveset. 
Oh, was going for an apron axe handle. Oh my gosh. Wow. One leg locked in here. This might be it. And he makes it to the right. I was about to say. This is not where you want to be. And Cody Rose doing the damage. Shamar was in control of this match. Shamar did say he was spoiled, and right now. He's showing him Cody Rose has earned everything. Oh my gosh, what a move. Shamar has to change quick or else he's going to earn himself an ass whooping. And as he's trying to get out of this hold somehow, and he does. He does. Yes, he does. And now he's making Cody Rose feel the pain. Back up to his feet here. Cody Rose with another reversal. Oh my God. And now he's going to jump. Oh, Cody Rose is playing possum. And Cody Rose doing a little showing off. And Cody Rose looking to embarrass Shamar after talking all that crap here. Shamar has to find out a way to get back into this match. Oh, a kick out at one? Cody Rose. A kick out at one here. Oh, what a what a reversal by Shamar! Way to get out the way here. The cover. Oh, oh, Cody Rose went for the elbow kick. Why am I targeting him? I don't know. Oh my God. And it looks like Shamar's going to try to put him in the corner. Here we go. Oh. What is this? Oh, he's trying to go for the suplex. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. This is a different kind of suplex. To the outside. Where Arn Anderson is looking on. Oh, my goodness. And you hear the crowd chants. This is awesome. This is what AEW is all about. Oh my goodness. All elite wrestling. As Shamar looking on as Cody Rose looks to be almost done for. What a suplex. One, two, and a kick out by Cody Rose. And now the frustration begins to settle. As Cody Rose was talking to Shamar, but is interrupted by a suplex. And here we go. Oh my God. And now a body slam. He's got him where he wants. Oh, Cody Rose with the roll up. Oh my goodness. Almost got the victory. And now. Going back to old mighty, to old reliable, sorry. And what is this? Shamar going to the top rope. He's trying again. And the, oh my goodness, what a corkscrew. One, two, 
And a kick out! You have to be kidding me. And Shamar is saying he's got this right in the bag. Even though he kicked out. And the, oh my God, back kick. Shamar said he doesn't give a damn what goes on outside this ring. All he cares about is what goes inside. That's what she said. Another DDT. And Cody Rose cleverly sliding out the ring. Now he gets back in. And a, oh my goodness! What a knee! Waiting for his prey! Keep your eyes on this one. And he goes to the top rope. No, he changes his mind. He changes his mind. Oh! Oh! Cody Rose playing possum. That might have cost him. And Cody Rose is planning something. And he plans this. The figure four. And it looks like Shamar is going to have to tap out. What a match. What a night to start AEW. That was an awesome win for this young man. One of the biggest in his career by far. What a battle. And it look, what's this? And Shamar offering respect. And Cody does. What a match. I mean, Shamar lost. But he did say, you will have to prove me that you are what they say you are. And Cody Rose did. And Shamar offers a hand. And Cody Rose has accepted. And we are back. We have just got word. Well, not just got word, but we have just got uh, notice that uh, breaking news Storm or Shamar has signed an open contract to AEW. This will involve him to get in Japan, to be in Japan and everything. So that is cool. And here he is, the TNT champion, Cody Rose, coming out here. Arn Anderson had to take care of some family business, so he won't be here tonight. Cody Rose is coming here tonight to give him an open challenge. What a match we saw last week between Cody Rose and the new up coming rookie, Shamar. What what tales for a first match? I mean, they went everywhere and they completely destroyed each other. But Cody Rose, at the end of the day, was still TNT champion. Oh, Y'all see that boy hands? And he was awaiting somebody. What the hell? Oh no. Bodie Lee has come out. Oh my goodness. And it looks like he has the Dark Order right behind him. I don't think this is for the TNT Championship. I think they're coming out here for a statement, guys. And they are going straight into it. They're just beating Cody Rose. They didn't even come out here for a TNT title defense. Oh my gosh. Cody Rose is getting beaten up by the Dark Order here. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. And coming in for the save. Is Shamar. Shamar coming right down the alleyway and attacking Brody Lee. This has got all under, this has got out of control. 
in a hurry. Finds a way to reverse. And it looks like Man, someone down. needs to get control of this. And ladies and gentlemen, we are back from commercial. It has been done and said that the main event will be Cody Rose and Shamar taking on Brody Lee and STU Grayson. Excuse me. Just two of the Dark Order. And the rest of the Dark Order are banished from ringside. If Brody Lee somehow... If the Dark Order pull out a victory, Brody Lee will be the number one contender for the TNT Championship. And we are live on AEW earlier tonight. We had a brawl between the Dark Order, Shamar, and Cody Rose. And here he is. With the fashionable signature motorcycle. He's been using to enter the ring. And he is here tonight to settle a score with the Dark Order. We just seen backstage that Cody Rose was talking to Shamar and he said, if there's anything I can do to help Cody, I will. He wasn't just gonna sit back and watch as the Dark Order beat up Cody Rose. Oh! Shamar with the high kicks again. And a reversal. To the DDT! He's not looking good here, guys. Oh no. Uh oh, this isn't gonna end well for someone. Oh my gosh. And Shamar is feeling it. Wicked oh, gut shot. punch. Oh, a run, another roundhouse kick. And a drop kick. kick. What? Oh, and Shamar playing games with Brody Lee for a, a person that has some skill in his ring. He is very childish. Oh my God. Childish and cocky when he is in charge of the match. An Irish whip and a swing neck breaker. He's looking to fly. And Brody Lee gets in the tag. And he'll likely pay for it here. And a, oh my god. And another impressive showing it looks like by Shamar. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. Showing off again in a float over to the DDT. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent. And another DDT. Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Team and another South leg American sweep. Alpha. Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming And a snap suplex. And when the tag team scene is feeling it. You don't know which team will be wearing the gold. We're going to make the tag here. A tag at this point can change the whole complexion of this match, Michael. And he comes up short. Oh, yeah. That was going to happen. He continues to press forward. He is getting fired up here. And showing off again. And up. Launched with a belly to belly. Belly to belly. By S2U Grayson. And now the Dark Order looks to get in control of this match. Once again, Shamar's childish ways gets in front of him. Oh, 
Oh my god. This match grinded him down a little. It might be time for him to recharge that battery. Hey, Shamar needs a tag. Brody Lee is tagged in now. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Just vicious head attacks. By no other than Brody Lee. And now again, the punches to the head. Brody Lee perhaps embarrassed that Shamar came out here to help Cody Rose in the first place. And Brody Lee has never said exactly why he came out attacking Cody Rose. I guess he just doesn't need self-explanation. And look, Shamar trying to crawl here, but no can do. Oh my God. Back body drop. Okay, Shamar fighting back now and a signature. Oh, but Brody Lee really reverses it again. And this match might just be over. He gets it. Can he get the tag? And Brody Lee stops it. Oh my gosh. And Brody Lee showing off here. Can it be an opening? Cross to the corner. Stumping away. Oh, stomach kick. Oh, a knee. A knee here. And Shamar gets the tag. Cody Rose is coming in. Oh, I did not mean to do that. And make a mistake. Cody Rose makes a mistake and hits the ref. Gets Brody Lee up. Hey, Cody Rose. Is looking to fire on all oh, cylinders. What a DDT! He is just reeling from that offense. Why he's still in the match at this point? Oh my god, it takes out tag team match. STU Grayson. Some explanation. He might have been away. Oh my gosh, and again, yet another counter and another DDT. And, as, and Cody Rose is feeling it. Hit. Where's it calling out? And now it looks like it. Now. And now it looks like Cody Rose. And now it looks like Cody Rose is nearing victory. And a kick out by Luke Harper. Hey, what the? What the hell? Are you serious? Shamar just hit Cody Rose with the chair. Witness. Are you serious? These guys were awesome. What the hell just happened? Shamar just hit. That's it for this tag team match. And what a thrilling match it was. Oh my goodness. What just happened? I'm still astonished what just happened. Shamar just hit Cody Rose with a chair. They are attacking Cody Rose. Arn Anderson is nowhere to be found because he's dealing with family problems. Cody Rose trying to fight back here. And a chair. Oh my God. And Luke Harper. I mean, Brody Lee is just sitting there. Brody Lee is just standing there. Sitting there watching it. What do we have here? Oh my gosh. Well, 
we will see what happens next on AEW. My name is I King Skies, and if you like this stuff, bro, slap the like button, drop a comment, and press subscribe. My name is I King Skies, and thanks for watching. But what do you do when there's no place to turn? I have